Welcome back. Joining me now is a representative from the Notre Dame Club of India. She's on the phone or on Skype. I'm not sure which. I'll have to double check that. And before I even ask names on Skype, I've been told, I have to ask, what time is it in India? It's about 10, 10, 10 in the morning. 10, 10 in the morning. Okay, so you're not tired. You're just starting your day. That's right. All right. Well, <laughs> now we can get around to names. All right. Can you give us your introductions and what year you guys graduated? I'm Ishira Kumar. I graduated 07, and I studied film and television. And I'm Dheeraj Mehra, class of 1996. My major was marketing and computer applications. That's fantastic. And so what, uh, what brought you, what, what took you back to India or took you over to India to, to start your careers? Well, I lived in India all my life. My, the only four years I was out was when I studied at Notre Dame, came back to my own business, and have been here since. And I actually, I lived in L.A. after graduation for five years and moved back a couple of years ago to just come back home and settle down here. Five years in L.A. was enough, right? It was, that's also true. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about the Notre Dame Club of India. How many members do you all have? We are a relatively small club. We've got about 80 members on board. Uh, not everyone is active. About 15 to 20 of us do tend to meet when we do have events. Football season. Yes. It's, it's a fun group, though. We do know each other pretty well. Tell us a little bit about those events. What kind of events do you guys have? I see game watches. A, uh, we do have game watches. We have uh, lunches where we, uh, networking lunches, where we do tend to meet up with each other. Uh, we have uh, uh, dinners and drinks, which, of course, I shouldn't say online, but we do. <laughs> oh, sure, uh, it's fine. <laughs> and uh, we are having our first service project uh, this year uh, in memory of Father Ted. Uh, which should be later in the year, maybe in a few months down the line. It's really great to know that his example and the model that he set is spread around the globe. What kind of service project is it going to be in his honor? Uh, we are debating between uh, two options. One is uh, working with the school, something to do with education, and the second is a service project uh, religion related, so maybe at a church. Uh, our team is still coming up with the final decision on which one to go with. And you both said your lives have been primarily in India, but with your four years at Notre Dame, what did you take from this experience that you took back to India and that you carry with you today? I mean, I think I made some of the best friends I would ever make, ever. And it was, for me, I think coming to Notre Dame, I didn't feel out of place even one day. I settled in from the, the moment I got there and I had an amazing time and made memories that will stay with me for eternity. I agree with Ashira on this. The best friends I have today are my friends from Notre Dame. Even though I live in India, uh, I'm in touch with them. A lot of them are around the world now, from Hong Kong to the U.S. Uh, but they're still one of the closest friends I still have. And, and it's so easy to touch now. I mean, especially through things like Skype. It doesn't matter that we're so far away. It still feels like you can talk to them and see them as much as you want. Yeah, Skype and FaceTime have really changed the way we all communicate. And that uh, probably uh, is the answer, the friend's uh, answer is probably what you're going to respond to my next question. But can each of you tell me what the best part of the Notre Dame experience was for you? So definitely the friends. I mean, Notre Dame was home, and it, it still feels like home every time I go back, despite all the changes and the fact that I don't recognize a lot of the campus. It still feels like home, and I think to have that place forever is something very special. I'd add one more thing to that is football. Yes. <laughs> a good addition, most definitely. And you're right, I completely agree. The place has changed a great deal, but it still feels like home every time you walk back on campus. And I think any alum would say the same thing. Thank you both so much for spending the morning with us where you are. I guess it's the morning here, too. 